Good morning guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'll be taking you through my Sunday morning routine. So enjoy and don't mind my face as well. Don't worry, it's gonna be off soon. So guys, I'm about to wash my face right now. This is really, really, really awkward. <laughs> Okay, so you can see all the drama. I'm washing my face right now. Whoa, hot water. Hot water. <laughs> my God. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to. I'm, I don't need to wash everything off because I'm still going to use um a, a cleansing gel. So now I'm going to be using my a new clean from 14 Max Cream Cleanser. And then the next thing I usually do is to take my purifying gel cleanser. My face is already wet, so I do need to clean it off a little bit of that. It's from Avon as well, a new, a new purifying gel cleanser. And I just take that a little bit and I lather it into my face. Guys, since I started using this purifying gel, my face has been smoother and fresher. My spots have been disappearing as well. I will leave details in the description box down below if you are interested in getting one for yourself. The next thing I do is make breakfast, man must chop. In this case, na woman. I'm having fruit and fiber flakes with a side dish of stir fried egg. I've got to get my protein in, you know. It's very, very, very important. So if you know that you aren't having enough protein, eggs are a very, very great source of protein. I'm not a nutritionist, but I just felt to drop that out there. It takes me about 15 minutes to eat, I don't know why, but after eating, I go in to take a shower and then I start having my makeup done. Hello guys, so I'm getting ready to do my makeup right now, so let's start with my pencil. I have, I actually do have, it has been raining all morning, I have a creative writing workshop that I would like to attend in one of the colleges. It was actually organized by one of my classmates, so they invited a writer, a writer from a different city to come to handle the workshop basically. So I'm going to be making use of my Avon shoe color. So this is going to be probably a little bit of a long video, but I'm going to try as much as possible to, to cut it into a little bit so it won't be very long. I don't know, my eyebrows are never, are never ever the same. Sisters, never, ever. One day one will be okay, another day to be different. I don't know why. And interestingly, it will be, it will be, both of them will be nice, but they'll be nice in two different ways. <laughs> like, it's just so crazy. Both of them are nice, but they'll be nice in different ways. So, let's see. Well, the weather is really, really, really rainy today. I really, and I know, I do know that the rain should have stopped by now. So let's see if we can rush up these makeup. So I know a lot of people don't like to do concealer. I don't even like to do it sometimes because it just like messes up the whole look. But because I'm probably going for a full glam kind of look, that's why I'm doing it. So I'm doing my brows first. 
I do my makeup in different ways. Like sometimes I can start with the foundation. Sometimes I can, I can start with my brows. Anyway, depends on how I'm feeling. So today I feel like doing the brows first, and then I'll go in with my foundation to blend everything out so that it doesn't look like the the harsh lines would be less visible. So yeah, so it's looking like I look like Mother Gagu right now on camera. I know. Trust the process. <laughs> you know the interest. The, one of the most interesting and fascinating things I found about makeup is that it's get to that point where during the course of the makeup it looks like as if this doesn't make sense like this doesn't make sense at all and then all of a sudden BAM you just see the kind of look that you were not expecting so I'm going to take two pumps of my Avon True Color Foundation Power Stay in the shade Walnut two pumps of that and then I'm going to dab it into my face I did not put primer this is horrible <laughs> so I'm going to take my Illuminating Skin Primer first and put it on my face I'm not sharing this, so I think I can press it anyhow that I want. I like this primer so much. It makes, it makes my skin glow. Shiny, 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 yeah. Shiny, yeah. Guys, if I keep talking, I will sleep on this makeup. So after primer, I blend in with my foundation, with a beauty sponge, and I am using my Avon 24 hour power stay in the shade walnut i use it to blend around my eyes my t-zone just in order for it to sit properly trust me this foundation is like the bomb since i've been using it like it stays all day every day i even used it in the rain like it didn't even dissipate I'm always so particular about my brow, so I brush it again and again and again. And then I take my Avon foundation in the shade Spice to highlight under my eyes, my forehead, the bridge of my nose, underneath my nose, my chin, my jawline, just so many places to highlight. And then I blend in with a beauty sponge just so that everything matches and fits my, plate, my face properly. After blending, I go in with my Avon Under Eye Brightening Illuminator in the shade Warm Radiance. I only use two dots and blend with my fingers, but I'm in a hurry today, so I will just use my smaller beauty blender just so that everything will sit properly and not look cakey. go in with my eyeshadow palette which i got from primark it costs only four pounds i know right it's not so pigmented but it does the job and then i line my eyes with my liquid liner from elf cosmetics just to make my eyes pop a little bit i forgot to put my mascara on in this section but i did that off camera and then i highlight with this palette i also got from primark for just two pounds and it's really really glowy like i love the way it makes my face stand out always perfect and sorry i forgot to mention lips I used my Avon True Color Shade lipstick in Ravishing Rose. The liner, the lip liner I used, I actually bought it from Nigeria from a beauty store called Casabella. So if you want to get like product, high-end products, you can always reach out to Casabella. And yes, my powder is from Black Opal in the shade number three medium which i also got from casabella and i'm using my avon domed brush to apply it in
so this is my outfit i'm thinking about wearing these shoes but it's wet outside so yeah i can only use this to take pictures <laughs> in my room i have to wear my tika boots because it's raining outside don't know if you can see it no swag shoes today i got the shoes from just fab actually it was a gift from my friend for christmas <laughs> so yeah so guys i've changed my shoes to my boots <laughs> so i'm more comfort comfortable it has a little heel these are more comfortable than a little heel so it's good for the rain the rainy weather I'm here at the we just finished our workshop and from here I'll be heading to the library. So yeah. I'm here at um, our students union and we are having game nights with some of my colleagues so I'm just gonna turn the camera over and show you how the people are here. <laughs> what was four again? Oh. The, the Toy Story. U.S. filmmaker directs The Irishman starring Robert De Niro as Frank Sheeran, a film based on something on this. Why? Don't know how to pronounce that. Question? Pizza! It's here. Hey? I was like, how do they get pizza? Rosie, grab the other one so you can let mine finish. <laughs> the game is are still on. I am literally very exhausted because I mean, tomorrow is Monday, and I I don't have any classes tomorrow. And okay, but I have one tutorial tomorrow. I really hope that we leave you on time because I'm really really exhausted. But I'm so far so good. It's been a wonderful wonderful time, and I really hope you're enjoying this video. I might have to cut it here right now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, please comment in the section uh, description box down below the next video you would like to see and thumbs up to this video if you liked it share it to your friends and please don't forget to subscribe see you in my next video bye